Vitals. Yep, Tech Rabbit here again. A little bit more special video this time. Just to um, go through the process of fixing our ball. Share this is kind of broken. So I have two of these and um, the problem is that they split the pipe broke where this weld has been on. So um, what I did is I made a 3D printed outer part with an insert. And we'll have a look at that a little bit later. And on the second chair, this has now completely failed. Oh, I tried to fix it with this. So this is the outside part slots on the outside of the pipe with the broken end in there. And then it was supported inside the pipe by this. And I even tried to add a screw to support it. But as you see, the, the whole unit has fallen. It's kind of, yeah, cracked. Fell apart. This is the other chair on the top part, so you can kind of see where it's uh, like. <laughs> I totally, totally ri ripped out the temporary fix and then the whole pipe twisted up, so it's twisted there. You got that hanging there. And it all broke off all these holders of the pipe. So anyway, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to cut. I was thinking we're going to cut it here. And then we're going to cut it here. And cut that away from, from what's left of that um, connection to the pipe. So we can get, get out this broken bit for further analysis. Oh, I've got all the broken bits removed. And then the idea is to take this, I know it's clear bar, I haven't got any pipe. And I'm going to um, cut this up with little slots so that it can be bent into approximately that same shape. And then I'm going to have to grind the ends so that they can fit in the pipe so I can roll it. Ah, got this fixed. But so far, I have to figure out how to get that. Well, it's a little bit pressure. Oh, now the support is better, I think I'll cut some. Maybe one centimeter bit. And well, one on that side and one on the other side. I was also thinking of doing it like that. I don't know if I can get a good weld. And then the other thing is that this now, on the other side, it's got stress on it, so ultimately end up adding one there also. So I think maybe like that, on both sides, do the trick. Oh, that's welded up. Both sides. Yeah, not very good welds, but it's bad welds on two sides, so that might equal a weld that will hold. So anyway, fitted it into place. And just to round it off the ends a bit, making the square into being able to just fit into the pipe. And then you need to um, weld that in place with a few spot welds. So it's welded in place. Not the easiest thing to do since the joining material is not very thick. It's actually, I think it's a one millimeter and then this is one and a half. So not that I did the crappiest job I could. Okay, well, and these don't take super much weight, so, so I just tacked them on as best I can. But it seems to be quite sturdy. I also drilled a hole through the pipe and then welded it so that prevents it. More. So it's got two welds on the side. But one has drill hold weld. So anyway, the last remaining has to put the hook on. So it's the yeah, hook back on again. I'm just gonna throw, or started to throw some bit of paint on top of it just to make it look a little bit better. Oh, nearly done. Oops, not that bad. Oh, 
Well, it's the girl. Wait for the paint to dry and then give it a test. Oh, it's the chair back in action. It's got to uh, fix some of this after it's been used for about a week. I noticed that it's going to actually hold together. So far, so good. Oh, now it's time to thank the main stars in terms of tools. So thank you, Cutter, for cutting up the steel and the slots. Grinder for using out the more offer slots. And the MIG welder for doing yeah, as best a job as it can do in the hands of somebody who really doesn't know what he's doing. Well, I hope you enjoyed that one. The idea was to show that if you have tools in space, then you don't have to throw so much stuff away. And uh, yeah, the family is very happy to be shared. It's like an operation working. You know, we'll see how, <laughs> how long it lasts. The other chair has the, has the same fix as this one had, but I've actually I know how it how the chair fell now, so I've reinforced the other chair. So we were probably still have one. Anyway. We'll see more time of this kind of stuff and how to use tools. Then um, subscribe, stay connected. See you in the next one.